This actor for on the camera is with me, Duncan Jones, director of Warcraft, which is an amazing fantasy based on the video game, of course. Um, you, you were a player, I mean, and then you grew up in video games. I really did. Yeah. yeah. Um, I've, uh, I, I, I read books, I watched movies, and I played video games. And that was kind of when we moved around so much growing up, those were the things I could always take with me. And what was so special about Warcraft? <laughs> Warcraft because you played Warcraft. I did, I did. Um, Warcraft is, is um, it's a great big fantasy spectacle. You know, if you loved reading Tolkien as a kid, um, which I did, then yeah. this, was a, this was an opportunity to kind of live in that world in the game. But then they had their own twist to it. I think they did something that, that was different to what Tolkien did. In Tolkien, the humans and the, and the cute creatures are the good guys, and all the monsters are the bad guys. And what Warcraft did that was different is that the heroes were everything. The, and the monsters, the orcs, you could be the hero no matter what you looked like. So this, since this is a role-playing video game, yes. Yes. did you play human or orc and why one and not the other? <laughs> I did both and I think uh, I was I was kind of uh, I was just interested in experiencing as many different uh, ways, you know, perspectives as possible. So for me, with the movie I tried to do the same thing. It's like my heroes are both on the human side and on the orc side. And the audience gets to care about characters from both sides. I know this was a big spectacle. You call it fantasy spectacle. Oh, yes, Spe spectacle. Yeah, spectacle. Yeah. And um, but the next film will be shot in Berlin. Yes. So can you tell me what you're looking most forward to to going to Berlin again? Yes, absolutely. I mean, uh, I've been out there a few times over the last few years, getting ready for hopefully this this next film. Um, there's just. Th well, there's so many reasons why I want to go there. One of the things that I find most fascinating uh, about Berlin is just the, the incredible pace of change, obviously, um, how it's changed since the reunification. And the fact that so many of the buildings that used to have one purpose are, are now serve a completely different purpose. But so you have this constant juxtaposition between sort of socialist architecture and nightclubs, or just these, these, these strange device, these, uh, this, this amazing turbine factory. Um, that we're going to be using that used to be a power plant and now again it's a nightclub. <laughs> but there's just there's this, uh, it's all of this this dichotomy and uh, and I think that gives uh, Berlin just a, an energy. And then you also have this amazing architecture that was being put up in the 60s and 70s um, that is sort of a, a futurism. Um, their idea of what of what the buildings would look like in the future. It's just it just gives it this very very unique look and totally fits into the aesthetic that I was already kind of interested in in Moon, and this would sort of take place within the same universe as, as Moon. I hope you get to party in Germany. Would <laughs> <laughs> you mind telling me your fans in Germany why they absolutely shouldn't miss Warcraft? Well, the reason you shouldn't miss Warcraft is science fiction has all sorts of science, all sort of sub-genres available to it. Fantasy, the gorilla in the room is Peter Jackson's Lord of the Rings film. And in my opinion, there hasn't really been another fantasy film that has given you a universe or a world to inhabit in quite as much detail since those movies. I think Warcraft is it. I think it's going to be very exciting. There's a lot to see, and I think you're really going to enjoy it. Right. Were you more successful in the game when you played as orc or as human? <laughs> um, probably as human, only because I spent more time doing that to begin with. But um, I love playing. I love the orcs. I love those characters. And in the movie in particular, I feel a real affection for them. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Tschüss. <laughs> Tschüss. <laughs>